Hello! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add images and media to your Substack post. Here's how to add images and media to your post on Substack. The first thing you need to do is to log into Substack. Open www.substack.com in your web browser. Log in with your credentials by selecting Login at the top right corner of the home page. Once you're logged in, head over to the left hand side navigation where you will have to locate the plus icon. So, at the left hand side navigation, you have a couple of icons here home, you have inbox, you have chat, you have activity, you have search, and you have the plus icon. Now, click on the plus icon, you'll be presented with two options notes and long form post. Go ahead and select long form post to start a new post or just go ahead and open an existing post draft in the dashboard if you want to add media to an in progress post i do not have an in progress post so i just have this post in here and i want to just add a media so let's say you've added the title and you've added the subtitle and you're right here in the body where you want to add media to the body of your post this is what you're going to do. To add an image, go ahead and click on the image icon, which is often represented as a small picture symbol here in the formatting toolbar. This is the formatting toolbar located at the top of the editing area. So go ahead and click on it. And a prompt to open, allowing you to choose from any of the options, add image, add gallery, add stock photo, or generate. Now select add image then you will see this prompt that will allow you to upload an image from your device so select any image that you want so let's say i want to add this and it will be inserted directly into your post and i'm clicking on open now you see that it has been inserted directly now once uploaded, just go ahead and click on the image to adjust its size, alignment, or just go ahead and add a caption. Now this image is currently uploading because it has not been uploaded fully yet. But once it is done uploading, then you can now change the size, adjust the size, alignment, and even add a caption under. That's it. Now to embed video or other media, let's say you want to add a video, just go ahead and click on the video icon here once you click on the video icon here you will be prompted to upload a video or to record the video and once you're done if you up click on upload it takes you to your file extension where or your device folder where you can now choose any of the videos and click on insert or head over to record and record the video of yourself so where's my picture then the next thing that you need to do if you want to add an audio here you go you can add an audio from here so just go ahead and click on this audio option and you can do record the voice over or you can do an audio embed where you can embed a, an audio in this okay so you pretty much know why the picture decided to disappear right in front of me but <laughs> okay i'm just gonna click and open again and watch to see how that comes up and that's just pretty much it for you to insert links head over to the link option here all right and click on the link icon in the toolbar and just paste the url that's it to add a document or file you can use the sub stack file attachment option which is here you can also of course add the document you can also add a document using this link option which allows you to add your attachment that's your file attachment now after adding your images and media you can click on preview here to see how the post will look for your readers so check that each piece of media displays correctly and aligns with your content so if you're still working on the post just click on just just leave it there all right and you can come back to it at any time and of course once you are done with the preview click on continue to continue all right just go ahead and click on continue to take to the next step which will now allow you to publish or to schedule the post to your audience so ensure that you have a good network connection or internet connection because my picture is just coming in and it's just going out <laughs> 
So, but that's it. These are just the steps that allow you to enhance your soft side posts with images, videos, and other media making your content more engaging for readers so go by the tutorial from the top to the bottom to get acquainted with the steps and of course once you are done you'll be good to go i hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search